Hey everybody and welcome back to Investment Honey where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I'm not your financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel and I don't even encourage you to invest, but what I am going to do is share with you my own personal opinion and views on the projects discussed on the channel. So we are looking at Z versus Project and uh, this is a blockchain based VR FPS RPG hybrid post-apocalyptic metaverse. Man, that's a mouthful. So uh, they do have an intro video basically right here. I do like the video, at least the music. I like the music in the video. Um, you know, so definitely I invite you to take a look at that. You know, should you be someone interested in taking a closer look at the at this uh, project beyond the video content you know, here on the channel. So uh, we see a number of uh, different links up here in the navigation bar. The buy buttons, you know, you can't buy it. I mean, so they're not linked. They're not live yet. So um, we also see some socials, you know, here right underneath the video. It kind of blends in. I wish this was a different color, but I get why they use red. It just kind of falls in with the theme, but I think I'd prefer them to use white so it would stand out a bit more because it is easy to overlook the uh, socials here. So um, moving forward, I do want to let you know, at least as far as my notes are concerned, that they did have an audit. It did pass with no higher medium severity issues. Uh, no pre-sale link, you know, yet, and the team is partially photodoxed. I have been able to find a certificate of KYC, so as far as my concerns red flags, the main thing is no KYC yet that I've been able to locate, you know, on this project. However, they did mention get, getting KYC, you know, on the roadmap. So, all right, moving forward, uh, we see here it says gameplay, you know, welcome to post-apocalyptic metaverse. Um, choose to join either humans or zombies fighting to save the world or destroy it. Whichever side you choose, we introduce players to the mechanics of VR through a unique story path. That emphasizes gameplay item discovery before unleashing them on the inner workings of the post-apocalyptic world. So, if you click on these, you know, it just takes you to videos, so just be aware of that. And uh, for Game Pillar, our game allows players to fully immerse themselves in unique stories of a post-apocalyptic world as either humans or zombies, fighting alongside their friends, looting legendary items, for exciting gameplay opportunities, taking part in a unique NFT ecosystem, and earn real money. So, NFT housing blocks, land and settlements, give you some information there. And then the art of survival. So, with an in game marketplace in the NFT ecosystem on either blockchain, you don't have to go far to share your unique discoveries with the world. Create liquidity for assets, scour pages of epic content discovered by real players, and alter, decorate, or personalize your own. So you can you know, actually visit the NFT marketplace. I'll let that load. So um, and here you go. So a lot of things in there, NFT marketplace. Okay, and then we head on back here. And then we can see on the roadmap, you, know, you click each one, and then it brings up what, what's going on, right? So a number of different things. Like I said, they mentioned the KYC. We haven't seen it yet. So uh, we don't get any indication of what they've already completed or what's in progress. So just be aware of that. I wish they would do that. But a number of things listed here, at least in Q3, Q4, 2022. And if you go back on up, at least, wow, okay, yeah. You got to click on the X to get out of this. Uh, we go into 2023 and a uh, number of different things, you know, highlighted, you know, in 2023. I'm sorry, I'm not going through it just because there's so much to go through. But one of the things I would say, you know, for the team, they need to start checking things off and crossing things off they've already done to make this a bit more digestible in terms of the roadmap. Because right now it's just a, uh, it's just a list of stuff to do, you know, so... So yeah, but a lot of things, different things they want to accomplish, you know, on the roadmap. Um, and they started obviously back here in Q4 of 2021, you know, so I like to see the fact that they are moving through with development all the way to the end of 2023. So moving forward, we see some tokenomics, um, you know, so we see, you know, what's going to what in terms of tokens. And then we see, you know, again, the partially, you know, docs team. You can click and drag this, guys, so, but it might work easier if you just click on the arrows but but yeah so you can see you know who's on the team and so forth you know so like I said partially photo docs you know but uh, there were just a couple of people that weren't uh, docs and those were these two individuals you know so okay and then we have some partners investors you know here nothing linked here you know so I don't even know why this is here unless it's just maybe too big you know to be determined kind of thing I don't know maybe so, um, but yeah, that's that's it, you know, on the website. So, and they got a white paper here as well to go ahead and go through 19 pages, as you can see indicated here. So, um, if you're somebody interested in this project, you know, again, uh, it looks uh, kind of interesting to me personally, but 
Um, don't just simply, you know, take your green light, you know, coming from me, you know, on any project. Again, we don't even encourage you to invest in this channel, but we do encourage you to get informed. So start with the documentation, get into their socials and, uh, you know, do your own evaluation and assessment of the project yourself as well. You know, so that you can develop your own signals that lead you into a project or away from it, uh, which further, you know, um, informs your steps in terms of your level of participation concerning any pro crypto project that you take a look at. So that'll do it for me on uh, Z versus project, and I'll leave the links relevant to the project in the description below. If you know anybody that's interested in crypto, you know, certainly share this channel with them, and you know, like, subscribe, and comment. All those things do help this channel to grow. I can't do it without you, and it helps get our content out more people on YouTube. So thank you guys so much as always. With that said, you all enjoy the day.